likes it. We all love a nice landing after a bar routine. Gets everyone the crown is pretty symbolic, don't you think? Olivia Dunn may not be the most talented gymnast out there, nor is she the most iconic representative of her sport, but she is, by certain metrics anyway, the biggest thing going in American gymnastics. Yeah, I really want my legacy to be spreading the word that you are more than your sport. And At 21 years old, the New Jersey native makes sure to make a difference, in whatever ways she can. She is willing to defy expectations and step out of the norm. You can be a student athlete, you can and be a savvy businesswoman, that you could do it all. And she may still have a long way to go to be considered one of the country's best in gymnastics skill-wise, but she is a huge name in the sport. Referred to by many as Livy, Dunn has an Instagram following of 5.3 million, more than Derek Jeter, Cher, or one of the gymnastics greats, Sunisa Lee. On TikTok, 8.1 million accounts follow Livy. So, yes, she's a huge thing. Dunn took up gymnastics at age three and bounded through an impressive slate of state, regional, and national competitions. She spent her childhood summers at rigorous training camps, giving up the sleepaway camp and bonfire opportunities that her classmates enjoyed. While she was polishing her beam, bar, and floor routines, she also honed her social media savvy. Fun fact, she has had an Instagram account since she was 10. That's at least half of her years on Earth. Her interest in sports did not come as a surprise, especially since her entire family is athletic. Her mother, Catherine, was a gymnast and cheerleader, while her father, David, played Division I football at Rutgers University. Livy's sister, Juliana, played softball at Pascack Valley High School in Hillsdale. That's not all. Olivia previously admitted that her cousin Isabella helped inspire her to start gymnastics because of the pretty pink leotard she wore. I wanted one too, she said. Although Dunn hasn't competed at the Olympics like Simone Biles or Suni Lee, she has attended national team camps at the USA Olympic Training Center in Texas. In 2017, she represented the United States junior team at the city of Gesolo Trophy competition in Italy. The group won an all-around gold medal. Even out of the mat, four bars, Olivia Dunn captures attention unlike any other. In fact, her social media popularity has led to big crowds at LSU meets, forcing the school to take increased safety precautions. Besides her huge social media presence, she is also affiliated with various brands. Dunn has NIL deals with companies such as Forever 21, American Eagle, and Vuori, according to On3. She also has agreements in place with Grubhub, Linktree, and study app Bartleby. By mid-2023, her NIL valuation is estimated to be $3.50 million, the highest for an NCAA female athlete. Throughout the past four years, Livy Dunn's NIL earnings have steadily increased. With millions of social media followers, her NIL valuation has risen by nearly half a million in 2024 alone. In January, Sports Illustrated reported her NIL value at $3.4 million, and by May, Bleacher Report noted an increase to $3.7 million. Now, after a multi-million dollar deal with social media platform passes, Olivia Dunn's NIL value stands at a rough $4 million. Passes allows me to monetize my creativity and expertise in ways that were previously unavailable to college athletes. Dunn told Forbes in May 2024. Speaking of NIL, some of you may remember that she was featured with other LSU athletes on a virtual billboard in Times Square on July 1, 2021, after NCAA rules changed to allow for NIL benefits. That's me! I really love gymnastics. At the time, Dunn had only 5.2 million followers, less than half of her current audience. I really love gymnastics and I really love social media, so I thought, why not do both, she said. And LSU is the perfect school for that. I came here and my social media just kept growing. Well, what's not to love? During her career with LSU, Dunn has garnered the Women's Collegiate Gymnastics Association Scholastic All-American title, an honor given to outstanding US athletes in a specific sport, 
Does she deserve it? Of course. Listen to this. 2021, first year SEC Academic Honor Roll. 2021, WCGA Academic All-American. 2021, WCGA All-American for Uneven Bars. 2022 seconds, Academic Honor Roll. 2023, Winter SEC Academic Honor Roll and 2024 Winter SEC Academic Honor Roll. She's something for sure. But wait, there's more. Olivia Dunn can now add a championship to her already storied NCAA career. In April, the gymnastics star and her Louisiana State University squad helped bring home the first NCAA Women's Gymnastics Championship in school history with a near-perfect performance in front of more than 7,600 fans in Fort Worth, Texas. Sharing photos of herself and her team, she captioned the Instagram post, 100% chance of purple rain. Dunn, who missed much of last season with arm injuries, competed on and off for LSU this season, including helping the team win its SEC Conference Championship earlier in the year with a 9.8 score on bars. Twice throughout the season, Dunn matched her career-high score of 9.9 last, notching the score in a floor routine that helped LSU march past the regional second round of the NCAA postseason. Needless to say, Olivia Dunn had an unforgettable 2024 season. After wrapping up an epic season, Dunn made it clear she's not done yet. But the bittersweet news is that 2025 will be her final season with the LSU Tigers. In a TikTok post filmed at the LSU training gym, Livy danced to the song. She captioned the post, last year in this place. As she gears up for her final season in 2025, Olivia has left a legendary mark that fans will remember for years to come. But did you know that she was in Paris for the Olympics? She did not compete though. But when she posted pictures of her experience in Paris, fans rushed to the athlete's Instagram post where she was posing in front of the Eiffel Tower with an American flag sweatshirt to ask why she wasn't competing. The said post was captioned, pardon my French. One person wrote, did she make the Olympic team? Another asked, why didn't you compete, Livy? And a third stated, should be on the team. Dunn's sister, Jolds, wrote on her Instagram post at the games, why didn't you compete? The gymnast jokingly replied to her sister, stubbed my toe, alongside a sad face emoji. Really though, there is a much simpler explanation for her non-participation in international events, such as the Olympics. Speaking to the New York Post, Dunn admitted that she isn't planning to ever apply for international duty again after representing the United States at the 2017 City of Jessolo Trophy. She reportedly said, I don't think I'm going to try for the Olympics or anything after, since I once competed for Team USA and I closed that chapter and went to LSU. Well, that's that. Now Livy is back at it. The LSU gymnast Olivia Dunn spent her offseason attending her boyfriend, Paul Skeen's MLB games, and also going on vacation with her family members. She enjoyed the 2024 Paris Olympics, and also promoted the release of LSU's docu-series called The Money Game. But it seems like the off-season has come to an end for Dunn, who shared a fun collage of herself practicing at the gym along with a gymnastics teammate. She wore a black leotard and happily smiled for the camera for the picture. On jumping into the thick of fifth-year gymnastics, Olivia Dunn admitted in a recent episode of The Best of Both Worlds with Flauje Podcast, It's just hard coming back from such a crazy summer and then having to do these things, it's such an awakening. She talked about how difficult it is to train for gymnastics and that it is a highly demanding sport that requires great strength. She clarified that it isn't all bad though. It gets you in the shape that you need to make the gym look easy. No sport is easy, even if it looks like it. These athletes just make it look so. Watch this to see for yourself.